Dear brothers and sisters, during these five magnificent sessions of General Conference, we have once again experienced that the heavens are open. I pray that you have recorded your impressions and will follow through with them. Our Heavenly Father and our His beloved Son, Jesus Christ, stand ready to help you. I urge you to increase your efforts to seek their help. Recently, Sister Nelson and I had the opportunity to preview the new season four of the Book of Mormon videos series. We were inspired by them. May I show you a brief excerpt from the scene depicting this Savior's appearance to the Nephites? Behold, my beloved son, in whom I am well pleased, in whom I have glorified my name. Hear ye him. Behold, I am Jesus Christ, whom the prophets testified shall come into the world. And behold, I am the light and the life of the world. And I have drunk out of that bitter cup which the Father hath given me, and have glorified the Father in taking upon me the sins of the world, in the which I have suffered the will of the Father in all things from the beginning. Arise and come forth unto me, that ye may thrust your hands into my side, and also that ye may feel the prints of the nails in my hands and in my feet, that ye may know that I am the God of Israel and the God of the whole earth, and have been slain for the sins of the world. It is significant that the Savior chose to appear to the people at the temple. It is his house. It is filled with his power. Let us never lose sight of what the Lord is doing for us now. He is making his temples more accessible. He is accelerating the pace at which we are building temples. He is increasing our ability to help gather Israel. He is also making it easier for each of us to become spiritually refined. I promise that increased time in the temple will bless your life in ways nothing else can. We currently have 168 operating temples and 53 new temples are under construction, and another 54 in the pre-construction design phase. 
I am pleased to announce our plans to build a new temple in each of the following locations. Busan, Korea, Naga, Philippines, Santiago, Philippines, Eket, Nigeria, Chiclayo, Peru, Buenos Aires City Center, Argentina, Londrina, Brazil, Hebron Preto, Brazil, Huehuetenango, Guatemala, Jacksonville, Florida, Grand Rapids, Michigan, Prosper, Texas, Lone Mountain, Nevada, and Tacoma, Washington. We are also planning to build multiple temples in selected large metropolitan areas where travel time to an existing temple is a major challenge. Therefore, I'm pleased to announce four additional temples near Mexico City, where new temples will be built in Cuernavaca, Pachuca, Toluca, and Tula. My dear brothers and sisters, may you focus on the temple in ways you never have before. I bless you to grow closer to God and Jesus Christ every day. I love you. May God be with you till we meet again. I pray in the sacred name of Jesus Christ. Amen.